بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو انادر ویڈیو آن ٹاپک گوگل کروم ریموٹ ڈیسک ٹاپ ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ایکسپلور دس فیچر اینڈ مے بی یو آر آلریڈی یوزنگ اینی ڈیسک اور ٹیم ویور سو یو کین بیٹر کمپیئر دا گوگل پرووائڈیڈ فری فیچر ان سائڈ کروم سو یو کین ایکسیس فرام یور لیپ ٹاپ mobiles, tablets, both Android as well as iOS. So it will be a really uh, nice feature to be explored or used. So let us see how it works and uh, what are the requirements to use this options using Chrome. Now let us open Chrome and this is my Chrome and just I need to write remote desktop dot google dot com. Right remote desktop dot google dot com okay so initially you will get this option and if you see right you can have this installed so i have already installed but let me do it again install so this is just you know like uh, pwa application so you can use this one or this one both are same let me minimize it okay like this so in this let me see on the left side you have remote access you have remote support so these two modes are there so let's say for example remote access when you are going to uh, host or um, make available this machine where it is there now the chrome then you will use this option remote access right and at the moment this device is online right you can change the name right and here you will give a pin right minimum six digits are required so you will have to give twice uh, just to confirm and save that's it nothing else so let me try once more i will delete this one the existing right it is stopping just to do a fresh okay right so by default this will be there set up remote access i will say turn on right this is let's say for example my machine name good to go okay next now i need to enter a uh, pin this will be required on the other pc when i will be or another pc or device where i need to access it so minimum at least six numbers right so let me enter right help you can disable and then start wow offline it should come online then it will be accessible meanwhile it will uh, come online let us explore the other features so this is uh, if you have to access this machine from uh, external devices right from your office or from your other place right okay now if you go here uh, remote support in the remote support share the screen so there is a possibility that you need to access others computers not your own own is this is my own here i am giving access i will access See, it is now online it got refreshed right so now i can access this machine how to access i will show you now so when you will log in it will show you here on the other pc when you will log in it will show you here because you are you will be logged in here in the chrome see here this is my account so when you will log in here there it will give you that okay now remote support this is share the screen so if i need to share this screen i will generate a code right if i need to uh, share this screen with someone else so i will share this code right it is just like other remote tools right so i am not sharing this because otherwise i will not be able to record it so what i will do i will share it in another pc and i will connect from here so now let's say for example i have asked someone else to provide me a code then i will connect from here and see how the display will be there so on another pc i am going to generate code the way i did above and now the code is generated it says 2178 
and it has uh, five within five minutes you have to use this code other, otherwise it gets expired seven and seven one six seven connect and when I will connect on the other side I need to get the approval so there is a button share I have just clicked it then now it will be uh, available on this PC the uh, the desktop of the other PC so it is connecting and this is the desktop of other PC right so let's say for example uh, if you see here this is my other PC and you say uh, stop, uh, uh, stop sharing and just to explore if you go to right there is a menu or options here you can disconnect so let me click YouTube uh, fu uh, uh, full screen and now if you will see this is remote machine right just imagine you will not feel that this is remote and you can move this somewhere else right now let me show you the other options uh, let us do here so in this you can scale to fit you can resize to fit uh, there are codecs uh, up to you these are frames for uh, the performance or the quality the more uh, you will set it will uh, consume more bandwidth smooth scaling these are the settings for control or delete right and for print screen you have to you want to use locally on your local PC or the other side, right? And configure keyboard shortcut, etc. This is the displays. That's it. Nothing complicated, and you can disconnect from here. Very simple, right? So like like this, and let me uh, go back on this screen. If you see here, so just a moment. So this is my other PC. This is other desktop, right? See, it's just straightforward. Okay let me remove this one i think this should also have some option to hide but anyway maybe it is there and i don't know right so this is my remote desktop on another laptop okay disconnect right i am back to my own pc this is my local pc right and it has op option uh, set up via ssh i haven't used to be honest you can try it uh, that's it. I am online, so I can access this PC from anywhere. If I have uh, my username and password, then I can access that one. Right? Please try to use it and compare it with your existing remote desktop tools which you are using. And this is uh, for free. There is no cost. So trying will have no issue at all. Right? Thank you very much, and Allah Hafiz.